A 10-year-old girl is recovering at Cozier Children's Hospital tonight after Metro Animal Services says she was attacked by a pit bull. WLKY's Ann Bowden joins us now with the latest details on this investigation of this case, Ann. Well, Rick, the owner of the dog, is now charged, but it's eight-month-old Playa, or the pit bull, who is behind bars. And a 10-year-old girl still has a chip of his tooth in her chin. She's got stitches all on her face. She had bite marks all up her arms and everything. Just before 7 Sunday night, EMS and Metro Animal Services got a call of a dog attack in the 1200 block of South 16th Street. When they arrived, a 10-year-old girl was bloodied and bitten with deep wounds to her face, neck, and arms. That they are very severe injuries. According to Metro Animal Services, this 8-month-old pit bull named Playa attacked the 10-year-old girl. For her privacy, her family has asked that her name not be released. According to the report, the girl was playing with the children next door who had just recently moved in. As they played, the new neighbor's pit bull puppy, chained on the front porch, started to get agitated. So the neighbors brought him in. But as the children continued to play, family says the pit bull broke through the front door of the house and attacked the 10-year-old, first grabbing her face and pulling her to the ground, then grabbing her arm and dragging her further. They think that these pit bulls, they think if they raise them right, they're not going to turn on a kid. You never know. It only takes a split second. Now the mother and other family members of the 10-year-old wait at Cozier Children's Hospital as she recovers from bite wounds that x-rays show have literally left their mark. And they said there was a little white speck, probably a piece of a tooth or something, but it wasn't hitting no arteries or nothing, so she wouldn't have to have surgery. But Playa's future is uncertain. You know, it's unfortunate that this happened with a pit bull, uh, per se, um, because they, they always get this dangerous name. Uh, but at the same time, regardless if this was a Chihuahua, pit bull, Labrador retriever, we would handle the investigation exactly the same. Right now, the dog is being evaluated and checked for rabies. Playa will be observed for 10 days, and no decisions will be made until after that time. The dog's owner was charged with possession of a potentially dangerous animal. Ann Bowden, WLKY News.